People with prolonged COVID-19 symptoms, also referred to as long haulers, and those who are asymptomatic could be offered the, should be offered rather, the COVID-19 vaccines. Associate Professor of Biotechnology at the University of Trinidad and Tobago, Dr. Nicole Ramlachan, quoted data from an article published by the World Health Organization to back up her statement. Indicate that the currently authorized COVID-19 vaccines can be safely given with anybody with a, a history of COVID-2 infection. And the viral testing has to assess whether or not it's acute, or you can use the antibody and serological testing to assess for prior infection. She warned that persons who have contracted the virus should wait for a few weeks before taking the vaccine, especially if they have developed symptoms such as acute illness. This includes people who have experienced infection after getting the first dose of the vaccine. So they're saying there's no recommended interval between infection and vaccination, but generally um, reinfection is low in the months after initial infection, right? So people are saying somewhere between two weeks all the way up to six months, I've heard, depending on who you talk to. Generally, it's usually two to four weeks um, to wait if you've had a COVID-19 infection before you've been vaccinated. Dr. Ram Lachan was speaking during a COVID-19 webinar hosted by the University of Trinidad and Tobago.